I am Miss Hill, and I'm here to say, let's open up book and read today. Books are hip. They're cool. Books will help you in school. If you read with me, here's what we'll do. I find reading fun with you. Hi, I'm Miss Hill, and I'm here to say, let's read together every day. Hi there, and welcome to Storytime with Miss Hill. My name is Miss Hill. I hope you're having a great day today. Let's read some stories with characters who are different than us and see how they live. Strictly No Elephants, written by Lisa Manchev, illustrated by Tae Yu. The trouble with having a tiny elephant for a pet is that you never quite fit in. No one else has an elephant. Every day I take my elephant for a walk. His is a very thoughtful sort of walk. He doesn't like the cracks in the sidewalk much. I always go back and help him over. That's what friends do, lift each other over the cracks. Today, I'm walking my tiny elephant to number 17. It's pet club day and everyone will be there. Come along, that's a good boy. I coax him the last few feet. It'll be fine. When I look up, there's a sign on the door. Strictly no elephants. My tiny elephant leads me back to the sidewalk, never minding the cracks. That's what friends do brave the scary things for you. Did you try to go to the pet club meeting too? The girl asks. Yes, I say, but they don't allow elephants. The sign didn't mention skunks, the girl says, but they don't want us to play with them either. They don't know any better, I tell her. He doesn't stink, the girl adds. No, he doesn't, I agree. What if we start our own club? Come along, I say, making certain that my tiny elephant follows me because that's what friends do. Never leave anyone behind. We can play here, one of our new friends says. All of us. So we paint our own sign. All are welcome. My tiny elephant will give you directions if you need them. Because that's what friends do. The it's end. random acts of kindness time. It's random acts of kindness time. For today's random act of kindness, donate clothes that you aren't wearing anymore. Donating clothes that don't fit you is a great way to recycle and spread a cup of kindness. People come in different sizes, different color shapes and names. Although we're different on the outside, inside we are just the same. Press the subscribe button to tune in for the next story time with Miss Hill. Thanks for joining me for today's read aloud. Remember, what makes us all different makes us special. You are so special and so loved. Thanks for joining in and I'll see you next time.